At the turn of the century in Omaha, the juvenile court system was, was just beginning. And the basic concept for children, if they got into trouble, was they would go to a reform school, which were horrible places, maybe an orphanage where they received little education, often they were used as forced labor, or go back out onto the streets. There was really no special programs for these kids. And that's when Father Flanagan came forward and said, I want to create a program to treat these children as individuals and help them with their problems. That was a very revolutionary concept for the city of Omaha. Father from the very beginning had opposition, uh, especially due to his concept of taking in children of all races and religions. And he had the Ku Klux Klan and different organizations threaten to burn down the home. So he had great opposition when he first started uh, Boys Town. In about 1920, Father Flanagan had the dream that he would expand Boys Town. So he decided to move to the country and his dream was to take in hundreds of boys. Uh, Father Flanagan's fame grew, especially in the 1930s and after the movie Boys Town. He was requested to tour America and give talks about child care. He was considered the expert in child care in America and eventually around the world. Father Flanagan took responsibility for kids. He saw a boy in trouble and he said, that's my problem. I'm responsible for it. I'm going to fix that problem. We're doing the same thing today. We're saying America's in trouble. Its children are in trouble, its schools are in trouble, its communities are in trouble. We're saying those are our problems. We're going to help to fix those things just like Flanagan said he was going to do back in 1917 when he started all of this.